Howdy, it's Matt. It's maiden time. I nav on the Omnibus uh, Pro Board V2. I've managed to cram it in to a Wing Wing Z84, and uh, which was actually it was. Then Dave's here with me, by the way. He's uh, here having a couple. <laughs> <laughs> it was actually an easier fit than the uh, Vector, ironically. Um, less bits to ram in there. So I have put, had to put quite a bit of lead in the nose. I've learnt my lesson with the. Uh, the old wing wing which is that they really do need to be nose heavy anyway let's get the camera synced i'll put the goggles up on the side and then you can join us for the real maiden weather's looking a bit odd isn't it hey weather's looking a bit odd yeah. cool. right right arm in all right and then quickly put in yeah right left up down. So we're going right, and the yeah. the right ailer ailerons come up. Yeah. yeah. And it, the other thing is as well, it doesn't always push it down as far. Hmm. So it's the same on the vector as well. And I'm holding it so it's right, and the hmm. was to its left, and its left right um its left ones come up, and then nose down, and they both come up. You can see there, like that, and then we put it up that way. You, know, you can see that on the camera. It's kind of working. But anyway. Right, there's a gentle breeze coming in front of us and I'm launching in pass-through mode for full rate, uh, well, half or middle rates on her. And this one's a little bit underpowered. It's only a 1000 kV or a 6x4-5 six by six by prop on it, so it needs full knacker. So. so it's flying. So I'm going to go and get a trim dynamo. Get some right trim on it. Yeah, I just felt that as well. Oh. Right, gonna get her up high, gonna hit horizon. Brilliant. Flying in a straight line. Let's bring her back. Yeah, and we can feel spots of rain here. So, full knacker, get some height on. Return to launch. Horizon. Return to launch now. And it is starting to rain, so I might have to land this one very quickly. She is coming back home. And it is raining. I can definitely feel rain now. I can hear it, Dave. Yeah. Right, that Dave, keep an half eye on that model just in case she tip stalls. We need more throttle. Um, what I'll do in the video description, I'll tell you in a moment. You know, I'll put a note up on your screen about the uh, cruise throttle or return to home throttle. That's not enough for this little wing in its current configuration. It's not going fast enough. So if you imagine that's a windy day, that amount of throttle would not bring that model home. So it needs to be increased. But it did come home. It's working fine. It's not tried to tip stall in. I wish I had the goggles on because we go and chase that seagull. Heading hold active off. Right. So it's in acro mode at the moment. Horizon mode, super smooth. That is full knacker at the moment. Just gone out of line of sight, well, over the edge. So I'm going to bring you in to land now. Landing, Dave. And that's the Wing Wing Z84. I might have to do another pass because it's still gliding. Here we go. Landed. Engine off. 
So I've got to be quick, it's just starting to splatter with rain. That was a new maiden of iNav in a Wing Wing Z84. There was one servo change which I had to change, which was servo free. I needed to reverse that uh, to minus 100%. As we saw, a couple of clips of trim just to trim the model in. Return to home worked. The throttle for return to home was not enough. So what I'll do for you underneath this, I'll put this green bar out telling you the setting and I'll put, uh, put the actual setting in the video description for you. That one definitely needs more throttle to get it home because if it was a windier day, then we would have had issues getting that model home with that amount of throttle. And that's due to the low KV small prop which I've got on this model because this model is actually designed for 20 to 30 minutes worth of flight time with a 1600 4S pack in it. So with that said, for myself, Matt, and the little Wing Wing Z84, which has got iNav running on there, it worked an absolute treat. Another successful maiden with iNav. Really, really impressed. And on that note, for myself, Matt, Mr. David of Penick over there, wondering how this rain's gonna go off or not. We'll see you soon. Cheerios.